That was a major success from the 2017 program to actually achieve a new discovery of those grades, some of the best grades of mineralization in Canadian history for nickel sulfide mineralization are right there at ENL. That was just marvelous. So, you know, we have a couple of, of approaches now. I mean, in one set of, um, one scenario where you have the doubters, I mean, I, I can't seriously think that the doubters, if they were responsible for running a small company, would actually, would actually say, oh, that's neat. Um, we'll go away and do something else now and forget about it. They'd be killed by their shareholders. And <laughs> I cannot imagine that. So Garibaldi and the leadership of, um, of Steve Rodgetti has um, have clearly taken a path forward here that involves testing this and actually find out, finding out what is really in the roots of the Nickel Mountain system. And that's going to be happening in 2018 with a very serious effort towards, um, towards building a resource there. Um, I can't make any comments about the size and scale of that resource. I, I simply cannot predict it. I do know that there are some very small deposits associated with small intrusions like, like the Nickel Mountain body, and there are also some giant deposits, and there's an entire spectrum in between them. I'd certainly say all of the features at Nickel Mountain in, certain, in terms of grade and in terms of the geological relationships you see encourage me to do the work, and I'm, I'm very hopeful we'll find a significant uh, deposit there.